Welcome back to our channel people hope you are doing well and this video will show you some of the best places to visit near Mundanahalli Nandi Hills and we have also traveled to a historic place and a beautiful beautiful ashram so we would love if you would watch this video till the end because it's going to be fun and very different than what we used to do earlier. You can see just next to the temple and the ashram there's the lake as well early in the morning this is highway there's a big banyan tree over here and then looks like this look at that big boulder just back of that boulder the ashram is there We are going up to the ashram. Lot of monkeys there on the boulder. Silish. We are taking Justin also. This is a small tour of the ashram. You could do meditation inside the cave. It's a beautiful place. The energy is very positive. And then there are a lot of places to wander around, right, in the ashram. So that's what we did. So we walked the stairs and there was a small statue of some goddess on top and the view from the top was amazing because you could see the Skandagiri hill on the other yeah. side with clouds flowing around right and then you could also see a glimpse of the lake on the other side so a very positive environment with winds blowing nature all around and the lovely blessings that we could get from this positive place right so so we loved it and if you're traveling to nandi hills mundanelli you should go and visit the ashram and seek some blessings if you are interested Look at that hill. It is so foggy up there. This is Kandagiri side people. You know, if you are coming for trekking, then for sure you can come to this ashram. Take blessing, meet Guruji. Lot of sparrow, man. Sparrows are going to extinct, right? That's what I have heard. You just don't get to see much of sparrows nowadays. Seva Deva Ashram, Dhyanagri. Where is it? Mudanahali. Mudanahali, Kani Vina, Rayanpura, Chitpalapur. So, yeah, we really had a peaceful time in the ashram. And after that, we had our prasadam and headed towards a different location. This one is the birthplace of the legendary engineer 
Visveswarya sir, right? So he was also the Bharat Ratna in 1955. It's close to Nandi Hill, Mundanali, and it says this is the museum, old structured office, and I think that's his house that side. The gate is closed, but let me try and show you the house. Yeah, so this is the place where he served the Mysore king, I guess, and I think one of the most educated engineers from the south, celebrated all across India. So it opens at 11 a.m. till 4.30 p.m. So we are a little early uh, but yeah this is how it looks. You can see the house there, old style South Indian house, pretty decent open area in the front and this could be the office of Visveswara sir. Yeah, that's it, people, for now. Where the Samadhi is, let's see. Thank you, Ida. Where is the Samadhi? That's Samadhi? Right side. Oh, right side. Looks like a small garden park. You see the background. Okay, oh, so there it is. people this is how we really spent our time in the ashram if you wish to come to this ashram do visit have a lake uh, just next to the ashram you can have a picnic there you can get your children along with you while returning back we could see this monkey we couldn't stop feeding him yeah overall it was a lovely day if you are new to our channel please do not forget to subscribe and see you in the next vlog bye